video. This is one of our um, standard king size rooms. Now this one is a little bit deceiving because of the entryway. Not all of our standard kings have this entry. Uh, this particular room does, so we gave it a sofa bed as well. Pretty cool though. <coughs> yeah, the angle of the building. Yeah. Yeah, it's a cool bench. Um, all of the safari rooms also yeah, have Starbucks space in all of the mm -hmm. rooms. Yeah, um, this is also, this is the adjoining room, so I will show you guys the mini suite next. So this is what you would adjoin to. Um, if you guys can feel, what we did was, on our second floor rooms, we didn't just do a regular double pad, we went with cork underneath the padding. For sound roof. Yeah. So that if somebody's walking upstairs, you don't yeah. hear it as much. We do get a lot of families, so if kids are running around, yeah. you don't want your first floor rooms to be bothered. Yeah. Right, so it's quite. Uh, I can't make apartment do that. Good. <laughs> well, they can. Well, they can. Yeah, well, I know. I wish apartments, <laughs> like condo buildings, would do that. Yeah. 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 Some of, some of the other hotels. That's the biggest complaint because they they tried to go with hard uh, floors on uh, uh, above ground uh, rooms, and no matter what you do with those, the click clack, uh, mm -hmm. you just you always hear it uh, underneath. That's been one of the biggest complaints. We have a couple of hotels that that did that in the city and immediately regret it because you, you just can't avoid it. Especially when you have heels walking on those hard floors. 